Hads, are we gonna do a painting today? Yes. What are we gonna paint? A fall tree. Yeah, we're gonna do a really cool fall painting today. It's gonna be super awesome of a tree, and it's gonna be a lot like our uh, cherry blossoms or spring blossom tree that we did a long time ago, okay? Okay. So we got a lot of art supplies, and should we show our art friends what they are? Yeah. We have... Straws? Yes, we have two straws, for one for each of us, and we have two... Paint brushes. Yes, and we got a bunch of paint, and we also have some paper. This is special paper. This isn't the usual paper that we use. This is watercolor paper, and it's from Strathmore. We have a whole stack of it. And this we like using when we when we do paintings because it's thicker than regular printer paper. But if our art friends don't have this, they can just use regular printer paper. It's okay. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> All right, so what colors do we have? Red, orange, yellow, black. Yeah, what else do we have in our black? We have some extra stuff in there, huh? Yeah. Yeah, so we got some water in there, and that's to thin it out because acrylic, we're using acrylic paints, and we want to be able to blow the black paint with our straws and so we add some water so it's a little bit thinner and easier to blow. And we're just using regular uh, acrylic paint from the Fine Touch. I kind of like, I like this brand because it's it's cheap. For $7, you get this whole thing. So pretty cool, huh? Yeah. Yeah. And then we also have a bunch of water so that we can rinse out our brushes. Yeah. And then we have some paper towels. You ready to start? Yeah. Okay. Let's stop talking. We're going to mix this up. There's a little extra. We're going to mix it with the water. Okay, first step we're gonna do is we're gonna paint this the uh, trunk of our tree. Okay, so it's a trunk is a lot thicker than the branches, so we want it really runny, and we're gonna put a nice thick line right here in the middle. Can you do that? Yes. Okay, I'm gonna get a little puddle on there. A little teeny puddle. Yeah, teeny. it's kind of a big puddle. Mm. Good. Get some more on there. Get a bunch. Okay, you wanna make sure that there's a nice puddle on your paper, and we're gonna get our straws, and we're gonna blow, watch this. <gasps> Whoa. Is that cool? <laughs> Go ahead, you try it. Okay. <laughs> blow really hard, it's super, super hard. <laughs> try again. Okay. <laughs> yeah, really hard, blow right up there. Yes, that's awesome. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna keep doing this a little bit more, and it's important to take breaks so that we don't get uh, headaches. Okay, because <laughs> we're gonna do a lot of blowing. Hey, All yeah. right, so let's fast forward. Okay. Hey. Good job, Hads. It looks super awesome. Now, the most important thing we want to do is we want to let it dry right now because when we paint uh, the orange, red, and yellow, we don't want it to mix with the black. So we want to make sure that the branches are all dry before we put paint on top, okay? Okay. Okay, Hads, our trees are all dry, and what we did to speed it up was we used a... What? Blow dryer. Yeah, we used a blow dryer uh, to speed up the drying so we didn't have to wait, right? Yeah. So let's move our black because we're out, we're done with that and we're going to move our yellow back. So now we're going to paint the, the leaves and this is super easy. We're just going to use, um, we're just going to use our paint brushes, get some, uh, some orange on it and then we're just going to do dots like that. Okay. Is that cool? Yeah. <laughs> so we're going to go around and then we'll do one color first and then we'll rinse out our brushes and then we'll do the next color. But let's speed this all up, okay? Okay. All right. Right, right now. now. Okay, heads, we got all of the leaves on the tree, but what happens in the fall? They what happens to the leaves? They fall off. Yeah, you're yes. right. So we should make some leaves on the ground. So the next step is we're going to do the same dots that we did up on the tree, but let's do them down on the ground and we can fill in the whole ground so it's covered with leaves, okay? Okay. So do lots of dots. Like this? Yes.
hands. That looks awesome. He did such a good job. It looks like a fall explosion, doesn't it? <laughs> did you have a lot of fun? Yes. Yeah. Yes, I did too. That was a blast. Now the important thing is you want to make sure that you let these dry for a good amount of time because the paint is really thick on here, so it's going to take a little extra time for, for it to dry. Give me five. Boom. We hope that this art project was a lot of fun for you guys too. We'll see you later, our friends. Goodbye. Bye. like a tree. Maybe I should paint some leaves on you. <laughs>